So today I want to talk about how to order Koko Ichi in Japanese. Ordering in Japanese is not as hard as you think. So first you'll need to figure out the main topping you want and just maybe point at the picture or learn how to say that in Japanese on your own. But after that, you'll need to say how much rice you want. And the normal amount of rice is 300 grams. If you want anything besides 300 grams of rice, this is what you're going to want to remember. So let's start with 200. Ni hyaku. 200. The regular or standard was san byaku. 300. Then you have yon hyaku. Go hyaku. Rop pyaku. Nana hyaku. Or hap pyaku. Now remembering hundreds is a little difficult, but you'll get into it. If you don't remember the hundreds, just say some number, then hyaku, and the clerk will get it. But for curry spiciness, it's a lot easier. And the word for spiciness is kara. So it's really easy if you know the numbers between one and 10. Let's just go through them real quick. Ichi kara. Ni kara. San kara. Yon Kara, go kara, roku kara, nana kara, hachi kara, kyu kara, and the spiciest ju kara. So how about I give you a sample of my favorite order at Coco's for lunch? Here we go. Los katsu kare. 200グラムライス。3から。チーズトッピング。Did you get it? Let's go through it. So, roast katsu is pork cutlet, and you'll need to know your favorite as well. So, if you have questions, feel free to ask me. Next, 200グラムライス. That was ni for two and hundred. So, 200 grams of rice. I said 3から。so the third level of spiciness. And lastly, I asked for cheese topping. Now that's a little bit of a Japanese way to say topping, cheese topping. Did you get it? So if you don't really care about how much rice or how spicy the curry is, and you just want the standard, I want you to remember one important word, and that is hutsu, hutsu, which means standard or normal. So when you order my order, you would just say Los katsu kare, futsu rice, futsu karasa. That's literally all there is to it. It's a lot simpler than you would think, right? So next time you go out, why not try ordering your curry in Japanese? You'll probably blow your friends' minds away. Have you ever tried a level 10? I know I have. And if you're interested to see me racing another guy up in Tokyo, you can watch in a link attached to this post. I hope you enjoy it and I hope you'll order your curry in Japanese. Thanks for watching to the end of this video, but guess what? Our relationship doesn't have to end here. Why not subscribe to my channel by clicking over here or like me on Facebook at White Rice Sensei, where each week I post lots of new things like free Japanese lessons and ideas and tips on how to make your life in Japan much more enjoyable. Hope to see you again soon and jane!